Welcome back to 80s Comics for the review of Gru the Wanderer, issue number 13 from March of 1986. Another hilarious issue of Gru. This time, Gru brings an entire functioning civilization to its knees. Everyone loses except you because it's funny and you'll be on the floor laughing as at Gru and the tale of King Sage. Look at the amount of detail in this opening shot. It's incredible. I love the artwork in Gru. I love everything about Gru. I love that Gru brings pain, misery, and disappointment wherever he goes. And it's always such great fun. Also, GoBots and Nestle Quick. They go so well together because you can drown the GoBots in your glass of milk with the Nestle Quick. I've never tried that, but it is technically feasible. I also love these cans. Weren't those fun? You take the knife, you pop the lid off. Just something immensely enjoyable about that. Anyway, after enjoying this incredible drawing of Captain America dancing, Cap's going to star in a Broadway show. That doesn't actually seem all that unrealistic these days. They take the MCU and put it on Broadway. I feel like that's a moneymaker. Someday. Speaking of moneymakers, for all of 75 cents back in the day, you got so much. This is great. So Gru cuts his way into the king. Quite literally. And the king is... He, it's, it's apparently somebody he's already, he already knows. I, forget, I don't know the backstory, but he and the king go way back. And the king doesn't really like him all that much, but he, he's... Uh, He's not going to tell him that to his face. So basically what he does is he sends Gru on an impossible mission just to get rid of him. So, what Gru wants to do is command the armies. Of course, that's not what he's going to do. What he's going to do is get sent to the most distant outpost. <laughs> I will be a great general. The sage is wise enough to see that. Look at him, sitting there, trying to decide on which mission he will first send me. How can I get him killed for certain? So much detail. So much food in this shot. There's like endless shots of food in this book. It's incredible. Can you tell I'm hungry? <laughs> As it turns out, nobody's excited to go with Gru, so he doesn't have a very big team to travel with. All of you are in for life. You can be freed by joining Gru's army. Gru? The Gru? Thank you, but we would rather just stay here. Resume flogging. Torture and starvation we can take. Gru would kill us. Are they talking about Gru or episode one? Defend the North Passage for years if you must. Do not hurry back. And what Gru is going to do is spread the decree that all land must be farmed. So he travels north. He makes the sheep herders or the goat herders start farming. He makes the fishermen start farming. He makes the bricklayers start the farm. He, he breaks their boats. He destroys everything. He causes incredible sound effects. One of my favorite things about 80s comics. They really had nice sound effects. Whack! Crack! To make a long story short, also, you should read this issue for yourself. You should read all of these. They're great. One of the armies returns from the Crusades, basically, only to find out that the king has changed. They get into a fight and then eventually storm the castle, along with all the people who have been forced to become farmers and are miserable and fa failures at farming. And Gru, of course, is run out of the country and manages to survive for many other comic books because the Gru series ran for a long time. And this is issue 13. It's really good. Another laugh-out-loud, well-illustrated issue of Gru... The Wanderer, highly recommended on 80scomics.com. Your favorite heroes come to life. Transformers, G.I. Joe, Sec Sectars. I remember the Sectars. The Sectars are pretty cool, but I'm not sure I put them on the same page with Transformers and G.I. Joe, but... Maybe they had high hopes for the comic book series. Didn't last that long. I have that issue. Those are better. Gru. Well, Gru's in a league of its own. Gru is like the stand, this standout 80s comic sensation that doesn't even feel like an 80s comic. It's just, it's just brilliant. And if you think it looks good, you're gonna love it. Pick up a copy of Gru the Wanderer, issue 13. Highly recommended by 80scomics.com.